back and good morning. I'm in Houston right now. So I'm on my way to Creator Day right now. Late, of course. So I'm always late to everything. Habitually late all the time. I'm gonna get there with maybe 10 minutes to spare and then it's downtown. And if you know anything about Houston, traffic is a biatch. And also parking downtown is a biatch. I couldn't sleep last night until maybe five o'clock in the morning. I was so nervous. I woke up at seven and nothing was going right with my face. I was like, oh my God, I'm a makeup guru and I can't get makeup onto my face. I was so upset. I'm so angry with myself. Luckily the roads are clear. It's only gonna take me about 45 minutes to go from Texas City to Houston. It's where I'm driving from. So yeah, why am I cutting off my forehead? Really excited to network with people and learn about YouTube, YouTube, YouTube. Really get my channel going, you know what I'm saying? Right when I shut the camera off, my GPS told me that there was gonna be a five minute delay. So sweet of her to tell me, right? Uh, okay, so just a little bit of background. Graveyard Girl, also known as Bunny Meyer. She's been on YouTube since 2010, and she has 5.7 million subscribers. So she knows what she's doing. Um, her fans, as you may have heard in the trailer, are known as the Swamp Family, and she's a Houston native. So she's one of your own. 
Um, totally independent. I think this is really interesting as well. No MCN, no manager, nothing. She does absolutely everything herself. Woo! So, buddy, if you wouldn't mind, will you just tell everybody how you got started on YouTube? Um, actually, you know, can I just, is it, can you hear should I, yes, you or can I can project. It. Which one's better? Yeah. I feel like Mike is kind of like, oh, Mike, I'm okay. there, Mike's side. Yeah, I know, I feel like I'm like, hey, Anthony. Um, <laughs> yeah, so I originally started based on a suggestion from a friend who worked at the Apple store. I used to design clothing all throughout college, and I was still actually in college when I started my YouTube channel, so it was kind of like a good transition. You know, I never kind of had that period where I was like, oh, God, what am I going to do? Um, so I was, I was designing clothes, I was in a really bad car accident, and my right hand, which is my dominant hand, got broken. I had a friend who knew that I was really into makeup and also into computers, and he actually showed me Candy Johnson's video and was like, oh, see this, see this girl, you know, you love makeup, you would have a lot of fun with it, uh, why don't you give it a try? And, you know, I originally started it just kind of thinking that it would be a hobby, and I, I didn't really know how diligent. I, I don't know about you guys, but like sometimes I'm like, today I'm going to start a journal. You know, and then it'll be like, there's like three entries, and then you're like a yeah. journal, you know? Yeah. So it's kind of like when I first started, I didn't I didn't know how I would feel about it, but it was just like such an amazing community, and it's kind of like right away I was like connecting with people, and you know, I kind of felt like I would be leaving behind people if I, if I didn't stick with it, you know? So I guess it was just kind of like immediately I was like really immersed in kind of like the creative side. And a little quick background. Yeah, I feel like I'm kind of like a chameleon or, I, I always refer to my channel as like a grab bag. I'm technically under the how to and style category, but I don't really ever let anything limit me. Like if I see a new like technology device, I'm like, oh, I want to try that. You know, I'm not like, oh, I am, I'm a beauty channel. I won't do that. You know, I kind of feel like it's like, if you have one thing that you're really passionate about and like that's, that encompasses all of your interests, then you know, by all means, I mean, that's, I feel like that's what the categories are there for. Um, even though I, I almost feel like those are almost like kind of obsolete. Yeah, they're, they're kind of like everything's a mismatch. Yeah, yeah. So, uh, but I just I try and not ever like let myself be limited and just kind of like whatever I'm passionate about. Oh, I'll talk about that, you know. So, um, but I guess I do a fair amount of you know product testing. Um, my most popular series is does this thing really work? where I test out a lot of like uh, gimmicky as seen on TV products. Gimme wins. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> um, but uh, you know, I always, I, I always like love makeup. So I do a lot of like uh, first impression Friday or traditional things that you would see on a beauty channel, like, you know, outfit of the day or, um, you know, I don't know. I feel, I feel like the game has changed since I got into it, you know, because we used to have a thing that even called where you could leave a video response that's the word I'm thinking that was a long time ago that was a long time ago so I feel like some of these categories now they're almost kind of like changing up because it's like oh I'm gonna tag five people <laughs> and now it's kind of like you know but every time the system changes there's always like new better things you just relearn the system <laughs> I am at the World of Music headquarters and like Beyonce's dad is like 10 feet away from me but I walked away from him and I'm just wandering around. What are those? I'm in a room filled with Queen Bay. Yes. Kill it. Oh my god, look. Everything is so the cute. So cute. I'm sorry, I'm turning up so fast. Oh this decor though. It's cute.
This is Mean Mug 713. Hey. hey. What's up? Yeah. I heard he has a million subscribers. Yeah, I'm trying to get him this car. You know, you can check me out, Mean Mug 713. We shouldn't be Oh, thanks. Right. Hey. <laughs> My pretty ladies. Little black, little black, little black dress 88 and watch the train. And here's the guy that took a picture with Graveyard Girl. Right? Jelly. Right? What's your channel? Show me your tag. It's Jackram. Jackram official. Ooh. Yeah. So what makes you official? Did someone try to steal your name? Yeah, somebody stole my name. Oh my god. Bunch of losers, right? Oh my god, what haters. Like how many Todd Grams are there in a, is it Todd? Surprisingly so. But I am the official Graham Cracker Todd Graham. Yay! Oh my god, look at this. Oh my god. Yeah. Work. Oh my god. Yes. Live. Red. Yes. I'm like so in love with this. Technology got us life. I got the booty. I got the booty. Who got this man looking through a cardboard box? I can't just give it away. Does it fit in your macros? The light is so, oh my god. It's Flex Friday. A little bit. Hey, hey. What the? Oh my god. <laughs> It's okay. Oh, sorry.